It is Jasmine here. See, I am sitting on the porch. I just wanted to have a quick chit chat with you guys. I don't want to come off on here as something I'm not. I don't want to be some way on the internet while being another way at home in my reality because everyone knows social media and the internet is not real. Starting off with a job that landed like literally right in my lap. Um, it was a tech job. I can't say. I think I'm still under the NDA. So I can't even say what company I was working for, but I was doing contract work with one company through them and um, it was great. Like I really was one of those employees. I enjoyed everything that came with it, the pay, the environment, it was tech. You know, I got all the perks of working in the tech industry. I really learned a lot and I always knew that I would be teaching and working with kids because that's just something I'm very passionate about but working in the tech field it was like okay yeah like this is definitely something that I can actually use in the future and make the most of like with freelance type work or whatever we may have you so that was really nice working that doing that for maybe five I was I want to say it's been almost five years until this year here most of you know in the tech field we're doing a lot of budget cuts which means a lot of layoffs so I was laid off I was one of like, we've had maybe three, four layoffs at that building. And I was like one of the last ones. Like, I did all those things to help with the morale of the company, honestly. So like me being laid off, it really just cut deep because it's like, dang, like I did a lot for you guys. And all I get was, all right, best of luck. It was the first time I ever got fired, first of all, and then laid off something that's just out of my control entirely. They did call me back like two, three weeks later, but we'll get into that later. Like I didn't know what to do. Like I've been working since I was like 15 years old and just not having anything to do is just crazy. I do network marketing online and I do have my own resin art business where I make like vanity trays, rolling trays, ash trays, things like that. But this win easy because my husband, he took me out so he can cheer me up and we went to this park to play tennis because we love playing tennis. After we played tennis, um, we went to the little park that was right next to the tennis court and we just got on the swing and then there was this dad pushing his two little kids and he was like, oh, I saw you guys playing tennis. Yeah, I haven't played tennis since my leg injury like years ago. And he was like, oh, okay. And then he asked for us to play and he said, yeah, why not? So him and Aaron were playing and I'm just pulling them on. But then his kids started crying and running around the tennis courts and it was just so crazy. And then the mom was just like, you know, <laughs> once you see your kids running around everywhere in front of people you don't know, you kind of get all hectic. And I'm just like, don't worry, you know, I nanny, I work with kids, so don't worry, I got my eye on them while I'm watching the game. And she's like, what? <laughs> my nanny. Um, so she was saying like, we just lost our nanny. We're looking for a nanny. We need help. We only need a few days off the week. And I'm just like, oh, here's my number. And so, you know, I was doing that with them for a few months and their kids have a speech delay. So um, there's like a special daycare that they have to go to and they were waitlisted and they were finally called to go back. So unfortunately that was cut short. Doing all of that tech job called and I told them unless there's going to be a raise or a guarantee that my spot will be secure then I don't feel comfortable coming back and then I you guys saw my video I got an overnight gig like every weekend since the summer we've been so busy I'm just so blessed that I've been able to fund that and be able to keep up with the lifestyle that I had but yeah so basically all that in a nutshell just to say let you guys know that you're not alone and whatever you're going through it might seem hard and in the moment but i promise like things are gonna turn around for you so whatever plan you have set aside just know that god's gonna laugh and he's gonna do something that's better for you whether you think that your plan was the best plan ever like it's always something greater and i feel like since i've lost my job although it's nothing has been as 
lucrative and as constant or consistent as that job you know i've been so much happier i've been so relieved my anxiety um depression like all of that like i just feel so much happier in life like i'm glowing like everything is just so much better I sit back relax and let god do his work because at the end of the day there's nothing else that you can do and i don't want to mess up anything else so that is the bad yeah i just wanted to share that with you guys i hope it resonated with some of you um but yeah just wanted to have that quick chit chat with you guys hopefully you guys enjoyed this quick snippet of our tennis game that we played this week i hope you guys enjoy it i wish i got like a full view of aaron and i but it's just me running back and forth so either way um but yeah thank you all for joining me this week i hope i kept it really short and sweet for you guys um next week we're gonna be doing a lot birthday week coming up so next week's vlog will definitely be me doing maintenance and getting myself ready for my birthday because i'm having an all-white dinner at this italian restaurant and yeah so i hope you guys tune in for that I'm about to get a nice game of tennis in Y'all, look at this. You only have one tennis ball, you guys, so it's gonna be a very quick game, but it's still gonna be fun. We about to get it in. I'm about to win, y'all. About to win what? About to win this tennis match, y'all. About to win nothing. <laughs> comment and subscribe i am so happy to have you guys here with me thank you for tuning in this week and i love you all